everyone. My name is Rahim Nguyen. Um, I'm a young living independent distributor. Today, my topic is about respiratory uh, system. Okay, um, respiratory in, includes you know things we breathe in, and 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 uh, you know sometimes we have a little bit of sniffles, and um, in other countries there is things like even um, as long as it brings discomfort to the nose area here. This is um, in terms of the anatomy, this is the sinus anatomy and this is called the frontal sinus. So a lot of things get um, blocked here and blocked here and then sometimes we actually get uh, a lot of sniffles and a lot of uh, running nose and then probably it goes back flow into our lungs area and then we get things like uh, phlegm, and cough and all those stuff. So you have to really take care of what you breathe in. That's why we very highly recommend you to get a diffuser so that you can actually diffuse the essential oil. So the Young Living Diffuser is an ultrasonic diffuser. So one of that that um, I usually use is this um, RC. RC stands for uh, Respiratory Congestion. So it smells amazing. Okay, let me try this. Yeah, just one, two drops. Okay. And just take the sleep in, and it's nice. And you know, you can actually put it here and here, and cross. Um, you can put in the lungs, and can put the back because the lungs is uh, towards the back, so it's really good to put the back. And um, yeah, and it has water inside, so it can actually help to um, to loosen up the the flag. Okay, the other one that I like to use is Raven. Raven is also very nice for secretary. Um, it has a special safety cap in there. I'm trying to open it. Okay, yeah, just take one drop and again circulate three times clockwise and smell it. And it's amazing. I love to put it on my back. Okay, a little bit, a little bit, and almost even on my neck. It's oh, amazing. It smells so good. Yeah. Okay, the other one that is really good, I usually like to add it in. If I put in RC, I can also add in other oils like eucalyptus, globulus. So in the beginning, I love the smell. So I'll just put one drop. Um, I might not have any drop. Oh, it smells amazing again. Um, yeah, put it on the lungs area, chest area. Yeah. So the other one is eucalyptus radiata. Eucalyptus radiata. Again, um, yeah. Don't have to. Oh, it smells amazing. This is great for you to apply on the chest, front, and the back where the lungs is. Another one that I really, really love is hyssop. Okay, hyssop is one of these um, oils and also in the ancient scripture set. So it smells amazing. Oh, yeah, they have it. Okay, so just take a couple of drops, circulate three times clockwise, and oh. It smells so good okay, today. I'm gonna have all my chests and whatnot. And yeah, just gonna put it in here. It's good. Okay. Um, in the ancient days of the uh, in the Bible, it does say that you non know, hyssop plant, you know, they use it for respiratory congestion. So imagine in those days, two thousand years ago, that people are using the hyssop plant and the hyssop branch for all kinds of uh, issues to do with respiratory. So this is good for us and I love the hyssop again. Okay? And there's many other usage as well. So you can actually Google it or look at um, um, pin interest. There's a lot of usage for it. And the other one I actually like as well is oregano. Okay. Why is it good? Um, okay, it smells well, it smells amazing. It smells oregano just like um, your pasta dishes you put oregano herbs. So this this is more potent than a dry herb. So if you do use, uh, if you do have an uh, organ food flavoring, uh, EO, so then you can actually put like just a, just put a toothpick in and that's it for food flavoring because it's great. Okay, I don't have it here um, because the, it's not in this uh, showroom yet. It will be. Okay, so it smells amazing and uh, what is it so good when you have respiratory issues, you can put oregano just a few drops in the diffuser or you can apply it at the bottom of the feet. Okay. All these oils that I've showed you, RC, Raven, 
or can be applied at the bottom of your feet because the bottom of the feet actually carries, it has all the vital flags on all the organs on the bottom of the feet. So whatever you apply on the bottom of the feet, whether it's adults or babies or children, it can go to the area. But of course, oh, now my neck and my back feel so cooling sensation because of all the um, RC and Raven and heat stuff that I put in, it's amazing. So, uh, yeah. So oregano is really, really good for respiratory issues, um, more serious respiratory issues, you can put on the bottom of feet. Um, even if you were to go to um, see anybody in the hospital, you know hospitals, there's a lot of um, viruses and bacteria in the air and stuff like that. So oregano is very good for our own immune system, you know, so it actually protects protects us. So you can apply it on the bottom of feet before you go to the hospital to see anybody and then you can also only apply it when you come back from the hospital. It's amazing for uh, boosting the immunity and, 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 and around your space, your personal space. So it's great and of course um, with all this on me, I think I'm a walking diffuser. Somebody actually told me that I'm a walking diffuser because I got so much nice smells on me, of course, in a good and positive way, yeah. So, anyone who have respiratory issues, come and look for me. Oh yeah, there's another one called Myrtle. Myrtle is great also for respiratory issues, yeah. So it's again, re respiratory is either the chest, the front, the back, where the lungs is, and of course, the bottle of feet. And those of you who have taken care intensive courses, we have taught you the vital flex for respiratory issues. Uh, lungs vital flex, the sinus area vital flex, and the bronchi vital flex. So apply it in that area and do the vital flexes. If you do not know what I'm talking about, come to me and ask me about the care courses. My next care course is only going to be in March 2020. So come and look for me. Yeah? See ya!